You're using Premiere Pro, you have a high-end system, and yet your playback is extremely slow. There is a very simple fix for this, and I'll show you very simply. A simple explanation for this is the video codec. Yes, the H.264 or the HVAC codec that you are encoding to. Because these formats are very compressed, it has to decompress them in order for you to preview them. Not every frame in H.264 or H.265 is a full frame. So what the video editing software has to do is look at several frames to make one full picture. Now, a very simple fix for this is to simply transcode the video. I just throw my videos into Media Encoder, select the renderer to QuickTime, and then do a ProRes 422, and then it will process into a brand new video format. Once that's done, then I throw it into Premiere Pro and it is buttery smooth playback from there. But why is ProRes so much easier to process than H.264 or H.265? The simple answer is, when it transcodes into this ProRes format, it makes every single frame a full complete frame. This will significantly increase the file size, but it will improve the video playback and editing. So why is H.264 and H.265 so popular? This significantly reduces disk space and bandwidth. So if you have a website and you want someone to watch the video, you're probably gonna wanna use these formats because the file size is gonna be a lot smaller and most of the decoding is gonna happen on the viewer's computer. Opening media encoder, actually, you know what? I'm gonna restart all of that. <laughs> 